Tiff, the state attorney says there are 14 opioid related deaths in Florida a day, and he says that's reason enough to stand with Palm Beach County in this legal battle against a slew of pharmaceutical companies. With opioid addiction holding strong, Palm Beach County filed a lawsuit against several pharmaceutical companies alleging they prioritize profits over people's lives. Drug companies, the drug distributors, all need to be held accountable if they were involved with flooding the markets, putting these very dangerous, addictive medications into our communities. Wednesday, State Attorney Dave Ehrenberg spoke strongly in favor of the measure. His Palm Beach County Sober Home Task Force has netted 45 arrests and 16 convictions since October 2016. The task force did not receive additional funding from state legislature this year, but Ehrenberg says the work will continue, announcing the addition of another prosecutor to the team. Nationally, Ehrenberg continues to lead a panel of prosecutors across the country charged with developing best practices to deal with the opioid crisis. He says the panel will release a report on its findings in May. Now, a new report shows that opioid related deaths increased despite crackdowns on the pharmaceutical industry back in 2010. State Attorney Dave Ehrenberg reacts to that coming up at 6 o'clock. For now, we're live here in West Palm Beach, Whitney Burbank, WPBF 25 News.